Hey y'all, welcome to the channel. I'm an actor, we're on strike, so I'm making reaction videos. Today we're checking out the creepiest hospital ghost sightings caught on camera. This is from Slap Tam. Let's check it out. How you doing? I'm Callan and this is Slap Tam. Today we're looking at some freaky clips that you need to see to believe. So hit that subscribe button and get ready for more creepy content. Just like this. Good idea, hit that subscribe button. Hospitals are often the setting of many ghost stories and it's not hard to see why. These buildings are places of immense emotional turmoil where people are often at their most vulnerable. Among the many haunted hospital stories out there, those involving the ghosts of children are some of the most chilling. One such story involves a photo that's been circulating on social media for some time now. The photo is said to show the spirit of a young child who passed away in a hospital. The photo, which often goes viral on Facebook and Twitter, shows the faint outline of a transparent child standing in a hospital hallway. I kind of see it. You can even see a head, torso and legs. Yeah. Nurses working the night shift in hospitals have often reported strange occurrences and paranormal encounters. Many of these nurses work in areas such as intensive care units, emergency rooms and hospices where death is common. Some nurses have reported seeing apparitions of former patients with some even claiming to have had conversations with them. Others have reported hearing strange noises such as footsteps, doors opening and closing and even whispers. One common phenomenon that nurses report is the feeling of being watched or followed when there's no one there. Some have even reported feeling touched or brushed by something invisible, while others have reported experiencing a sense of dread or unease in certain areas of the hospital which they attribute to the presence of spirits. Healthcare workers also report encounters with shadowy figures and entities that seem to move quickly through the hospital. These experiences can be particularly frightening, especially when they occur in isolated areas of the facility. While skeptics may dismiss these accounts as mere superstition, many nurses believe they are experiencing real paranormal phenomena. Whether these encounters are the result of overactive imaginations or something more sinister, they serve as a reminder that there's still much we don't understand about the world around us. That's true. So could this photo really show the ghost of a child haunting a hospital? Maybe. It's hard to say for sure as the photo is blurry and the figure is faint. However, it's undeniable that hospitals have a history of paranormal activity and stories like this one continue to captivate the public's imagination. Hmm. What's a creepy photo? That could easily be fake. India though. is known for its rich history of paranormal and supernatural folklore, with tales of ghosts, spirits, and other mysterious entities dating back centuries. In recent years, India has become a hub for paranormal activity, with many claiming to have experienced ghost sightings and other strange occurrences. Chhattisgarh in particular is said to be a hotspot for paranormal activity, with many famous ghost stories surrounding the state. One such story involves an old hospital building which has been abandoned for many years. The building is said to be haunted by the spirits of those who died there, and many have reported hearing strange noises and seeing apparitions within its walls. A recent video uploaded by YouTuber Pradeep Kumar Bangda has added fuel to the fire, with many viewers claiming to see evidence of a ghost. The shaky footage shows a man exploring the old hospital building. As he looks down a hallway, he captures something rather chilling. Watch. Watching that again, there appears to be a body lying on a gurney. However, just seconds later, when he pans the camera back, the body seems to have vanished. While some viewers have dismissed the footage as a hoax or a trick of the light, others believe this is evidence of a real ghost. Hoax. India's rich history with paranormal and supernatural folklore oh. certainly lends credence to the idea that the building could indeed be haunted. And it's likely that many will continue to explore the abandoned hospital in search of evidence of the paranormal.
disappointing. Sleep studies have long been used to better understand the human mind. But what happens when a sleep study captures something more than just brain activity? In a video posted on YouTube by Paranormal Arso back in 2014, a sleep study appears to capture something eerie and unexplainable. The video shows a patient hooked up to various monitors sleeping soundly in what appears to be a hospital room. But watch what happens next. A strange white shape appears to materialise above the patient before quickly flying off to the left. Very strange. One of the frames makes it look like the white shape is looming over the patient it looking does. down on them. The video has sparked much debate online with some viewers suggesting it's merely dust caught on camera while others believe it's a Could genuine be. ghost sighting. It's more likely dust. Been associated with the paranormal, with many people reporting vivid and terrifying dreams that seem to defy explanation. Sleep paralysis, in particular, is often cited as a possible explanation for ghostly encounters. I've had sleep paralysis sleep many paralysis, times. A person is awake and it's terrifying. Move and may experience hallucinations or the sensation of an otherworldly presence in the room with them. Yeah. Others believe that sleep is the key to unlocking the mysteries of the soul, with astral projection being a popular subgenre of the paranormal. Astral projection is the idea that the soul can leave the body during sleep and travel to other realms or dimensions. Some viewers are suggesting that this is what's happening in this video. That's a stretch. Yeah, uh, I think it's dust. I think they were right, I think it's dust. Guernsey, a small island in the English Channel, was occupied by Nazi Germany during World War II. The Germans built a network of tunnels and bunkers on the island, many of which still exist today. These structures have become the subject of many rumours and stories, with some claiming that they're haunted by the spirits of soldiers who lost Could their be. lives in the war. Recently, an image surfaced online that's added fuel to these rumours. The photo, taken in an underground Nazi hospital in Guernsey, shows a row of beds in a darkened bunker. At the end of the row, there appears to be a faint impression of a person standing in the shadows. It's not known exactly who took the photo, but the photographer was said to be alone when the image was taken. That tells me it's a the hoax. The occupation of Guernsey was a dark time in the island's history. The tunnels and bunkers that were built during this period serve as a reminder of the island's past and have been the source of many stories and rumours. Some people claim to have seen apparitions of soldiers, heard unexplained noises or felt an eerie presence in these places. While some dismiss these stories as mere superstition, others believe there may be some truth to them. This photo has sparked further speculation and debate. Could the photo really show the spirit of a Nazi soldier? Or is it Could. simply a case of pareidolia, where the human brain sees patterns in random data? It does look like a person Whatever standing the case down may there. Be, the bunkers and tunnels of Guernsey continue to fascinate and intrigue those who seek out the mysteries of the past. Plausible, easily faked. Haunting experiences in hospitals are not uncommon, with many people reporting eerie feelings and unexplained events. A case shared by YouTube user Whip It For Me back in 2010 highlights <laughs> how spooky these places can be. The uploader sister for me. worked at an undisclosed hospital in California and had always felt uneasy during her shifts. One day, while comparing phone cameras with a colleague, the sister managed to capture a rather chilling photo. Why don't they disclose the which hospital what it is? It appears to be the apparition of a young girl standing in the background. The That's uploader creepy. speculates that it may be the spirit of someone who passed away at the hospital. According to the uploader, strange and odd things have happened to several employees at the hospital, from apparitions to strange lights and noises. While the quality of the photo may not be great, it certainly raised questions about the existence of paranormal activity in hospitals. It looks like a black and white photo from the eight late 1800s, early 1900s, and they photoshopped it in there. It's not uncommon Doesn't for it? hospitals to have a history of death and tragedy, which may it's contribute black and white. to the presence of spirits or paranormal activity. Whether this photo is genuine evidence of a haunting or simply a trick of the light, it's clear that hospitals can be spooky places. It's also, she's tilted. 
Her dress is going to the s yeah, yeah. I have to say fake. So have you ever experienced anything strange in a hospital? Yes. If you have, share your stories with one another in the comments. Fake. In June of 2015, YouTube user Javan Gatsa uploaded a chilling video that left viewers confused and creeped out. The clip shows several men exploring the abandoned Florala Memorial Hospital, a facility that's been closed for some time. As they walk down a darkened hallway, one of the men captures something mysterious on camera. Watch. It can be hard to see at first, but if we slow it down and brighten the image, you can make out a strange shadowy figure moving from right to left. The question yeah. is, who or what's been caught on camera here? While it's possible that the figure could be explained away as a trick of the light or an artifact of the camera's lens, many believe it could be evidence of something a little more sinister. Of course, there are skeptics who scoff at the idea of paranormal activity in the hospital. They point out that abandoned buildings are often prone to deterioration, and it's not uncommon for materials to shift or for natural phenomena to occur that could create strange sounds or visual effects. However, for those who have experienced the unexplained at Florala Memorial Hospital, the idea of a haunting is all too real. I'm prone to think that it is something to do with like an artifact or the video or the lens, but it does look like there's a shadow figure of some kind blocking the light that's reflecting off of the wall. Could be. That's the most convincing so far. Abandoned hospitals and care homes have always had a spooky reputation. These places often have a dark history with many individuals meeting their ends within their walls. It's no wonder that such locations have become popular sites for scary videos and ghost hunters. The following abandoned care home is visited by YouTubers Finders Beepers History Seekers, who seek to investigate the stories surrounding the building. So this place was eventually shut down for a catalogue of abuse, and the patients weren't just old. They were dementia sufferers, some of which were about Andy's age. It yeah. was really terrible. The home was reportedly closed down due to widespread allegations of abuse, neglect and deplorable living conditions. Some of the people were classed as being put in cells. The bedrooms were that bad. They were locked away, ignored, and it was just shut down for so many things. Didn't they forget to tell people about deaths? They had 10 that they got notified of Care Quality Commission that 10 people have died. That's so bad. The investigators wow. take their time exploring the rundown facility, finding evidence of its troubled past. This is. It, what does it make me think of as well? Like Chainsaw Massacre yeah. type yeah. horror film. Yeah. yeah. They even discover a logbook containing complaints from visitors horrified by the conditions their hmm. relatives were living in. Betty has developed bruising on her upper right arm. Please observe. As the investigators make their way to the second floor of the building, they're surprised by an unexpected visitor. Take a look. Hey, wait up. Oh, yeah, I see someone moving Hello. up there. Could be a homeless person. A shadowy figure appears to walk across the top of the stairs, disappearing into the darkness. Oh yeah, that is. The men quickly make their way to the spot where the figure vanished. Only that looked real. Wall. Oh, there's no hallway there. If you slow the footage down. You can indeed see a solid shape moving at the top of the stairs. Yeah. Could this be evidence of a former resident lingering in the place where they met their end? Yeah. Care homes can be filled with individuals who have suffered greatly in their final days. If they were mistreated or neglected, it's understandable that they may not rest easy in death. It's worth noting that not all paranormal activity can be attributed to the dead. Many things can create unexplained phenomena such as electrical problems, natural phenomena and even the power of suggestion. 
However, in this case, the evidence seems to suggest that something more mysterious is at work. Yeah, that's strange. Have you ever strange. experienced anything weird or eerie at a care home? And do you think the investigators have captured evidence of a real ghost here? Love to hear your theories and opinions on this one in the comments down below. Hmm. Hello. Yeah, you can even see like a little bit of a reflection on their bootstrap or something. In the comments down below. Hello. Yeah. Hmm. Seems like if the light was shining at a real person, you could see more detail, but it's just blackness. So it makes me wonder. That's a real shadow person. All right. Well, thanks to Callan and Slapped Ham for a definitely creepy video, even though most of those were very fake. Be sure to like and subscribe and leave me some recommendations in the comments about what to react to next time. See you guys later.